Round two highlights from the Champions Tour Shaw Charity Classic held in beautiful Calgary, Alberta, Canada. We'll start it off on the 17th hole. It's Craig Stadler. This from just off the green on the 17th. As this continues to release towards the hole, will it go in for an unlikely birdie? It will not, but he has a tap in there for the par. Disappointed with that outcome. Finished at six under overall, one under on the day. Tom Pernice Jr. on the 14th was making a mess out of this par three. And take a look at this. If it doesn't hit the flagstick, that thing is going five, six feet past, and he knows how lucky he was to hit that and tap in for bogey there. He would finish even on the day, eight under overall. Bernhard Longer now, we joke that round one, he was only three under, there must have been something wrong. Well, no shock here, he turned it on in round two, and he is now eight under overall, thanks to a five under day, putting himself right there in contention with 18 to play. Mark McNulty on the 18th, a round one 65, back that up with a 66, thanks to a birdie on the last, and he is sitting at nine under par, just one off the lead, heading into Sunday. Joe Daly now on the 14th. He had a bogey-free day, just one birdie on the front nine, makes the turn birdies 12, birdies 14 with that long birdie putt, and then we'll head over to the 16th. Daly looking to move to 10 under par, double digits is always a good thing after 36 holes. This from the fringe, and he drains that one as well. That's his last birdie of the day, and he is tied at the top at 10 under par with Joe Durant and also this man, Bob Tway. Surprising he has not won yet on the Champions Tour. He makes that long one on the 14th. He eagled 11 coming into 14, and then this is his tee shot on 16. as he would skip this up, giving himself a nice look at birdie, which he would go on to convert a tidy second round 63 to tie for the lead at 10 under par.